Hello, this is Gam from the Fricks Clan, and today I'm doing another food challenge. It's really been a while that I've been looking for all kinds of different food stuff to try, and I came across this at the grocery store yesterday. It is called Bomba. Bomba is a peanut puff, which is pretty much like a Cheeto almost. Cheetos puffs, you guys know that? Well, I got extra fancy, and I did it with the hazelnut cream filling. It's almost like Nutella. But Bomba is a Hebrew snack that is enjoyed by many, and I'm excited to try it. Surprised I could even find this. I researched about it and stuff. It's really good. Uh, here's the nutrition facts for America. I don't know if you guys can read that. I'm just gonna pause right now and read it. Yeah. Okay. And then here is the Hebrew and EU version of it. All right. And then here are the ingredients. I suggest you don't eat this if you're allergic to peanut, soy, dairy, wheat, or any of that stuff because I don't be responsible. So just take my advice and please don't eat this if you're not supposed to. So nice normal bag, Let's get it open. Ooh, perfect like that. So this is what a bomba looks like. You can see the filling in it, you can see the puff, you can see. Oh my. All right, this is beyond like one of the best things I've ever eaten in my life. I recommend this to you. If you're not allergic to anything, eat this. This stuff is good. It's amazing. Love it. I <laughs> just poured all of it right now. I'm literally just gonna eat all of these. Oh my God. Here's what all of it looks like. So, it's what it says. It's pretty much a peanut pastry with hazelnut in it and Nutella. Really good. You can get the normal kinds too, where it's like the normal peanut, peanut puffs. It's just not gonna taste with the Nutella. Really, really good. Comment if you had this before. And tell me, are there any other flavors other than the OG one in this? He goes, so I really wanna try this. Super good. And blackberry juice here, down the hatch. Okay, if I were to rate the snack out in one out of 10, one being the worst, like absolute dog crap, 10 being like, this is heaven. Gotta be honest, give it a, like a nine out of 10. It's a little dry, so like, you should always have like a drink or eating these because these could dehydrate you if you have a field or something, so I don't suggest you do that on the field or whatever. Eat it as a snack to get your carbs up or for fun. Honestly, highly recommended to eat this. Man, I still have a lot. Yeah, here's a look at it then. Said this is a Hebrew snack. You can find this in like the international food market. Near where like the Goya stuff is, I don't know if you know what that is, but food company. International, they have all kinds of stuff. And they're actually really good too. Like, they sell a lot of stuff, like coconut water and all that, for like half the price as normal stuff. So I mean, I highly suggest you to do that. Get the stuff from Goya and other stuff like this, Bomba. Here's, you really get a bang for your buck. You're like, getting the same amount, half the price. Amazing. Man, I can't stop eating this, oh my. Sorry if I'm just embarrassing myself. I, I mean, it's a food challenge. I suggest I should eat this all. So, if you excuse me, I'm gonna put a time lapse on so I can eat the rest of this and I'll tell you more. And then we can get to the end of the video. <laughs> I finally completed the Bomba Food Challenge. See, nothing left. Really good snack. I tell you, it's filling for sure. I'm already full after one bag. I think I can get any more, but man, I need to buy this again and again. Super good, I highly recommend it. See, this blackberry juice was full up here, already down here. 
Trust me, it's my favorite drink, really good. So, I hope you guys like the video, subscribe, turn on notifications, smash that like button. Thank you. Suggest any more food challenges I can do. That. Do me a favor if you don't want to subscribe or any of that. Thank you. Thank you.